Hi everyone, my name is Heather and I'm the person behind Happy Puppy Truffles. Today I wanted to share with you guys something cool that I found that's kind of part of the whole craft world. And um, I'm curious to see if this is something that's available in other countries. So if you know that you've seen something similar to this where you live, please let us know. But um, this is... Uh, tape and I know like lately these days like tape uh, masking tapes with all these different patterns has become really popular but the neat thing about it is it has this little area for you to uh, tear away so that you can open up something after you've taped it closed which is just so cool and it came there was like probably 10 or 15 more patterns involved I just picked this one because it was really pretty um it's called uh zite and um, it's just this really cute kind of, pape, of uh, tape here. It's 300 yen. It's um, released by Sunstar Stationery Company, which makes a lot of really cute stuff here. And um, I thought I'd give it a try. Um, and I don't want to waste too much of it, so I'm going to actually put it on a really narrow envelope here so that I don't have to use too much of it. Um, but I wanted to show it to you guys because it's just so cute. And this is one of those things that's kind of hard to replicate on your own at home because you need to have like special uh, perforated um, uh, knives and things like that. And I, I do have one, this little guy here. And it's a, you know, a rolling cutter for making edges so that you can tear them away later uh, for like making coupons, um, uh, different things like that, raffle tickets, stuff like that. So it's a nice thing to have. And you could, in theory, um, roll out some tape and do this first. But I'm curious to see if this middle part is actually has no tape on it, then that adds to the whole thing of making it easier to tear away, of course, which is nice. Um, so we're going to just give it a try here and see. It does say here, please open here. That's cute. At least they didn't like badger it with terrible English. That's always nice if they don't do that. A nice and easy to find starter point there with some tape that doesn't hurt it at all. That's always nice when they consider that. Trash, put it over here. <laughs> and um, from the looks of it, you just kind of choose how much you need and put it on here. Let's make sure I'm following the directions, right? And we'll just stick it on. So I'm just going to go ahead and kind of pick how much I'm going to cut off here. I think the only tricky part, of course, is finding the point to begin to tear it open. Um, sometimes with these, you know, when you have a bag, uh, it's easier to find the, the point to tear. So this is just some nice masking tape with a cute pattern on it. And then you can see here, if you, if you can kind of feel it, there's no stickiness on the back side of the place where things will open, of course. So I just kind of line it up here so that I get it right where the opening of my area is. Put that on there. Oh, that looks so cute. And then if I just start from one of these sides here and take that and just rip along that edge then you can just pop it open and it gives you this really cool way, that's so neat, to make uh, you know, crafts and projects and things and to give you a chance to seal something off and give a fun way to open it up. Um, definitely super, super cool and uh, with all the different patterns available it'd be fun to get, especially with Christmas just around the corner. I know I'm pr probably talking about it way too early, but it never is too early to start getting started on Christ Christmas crafts. But um, just a neat idea. So, um, and there, uh, you know, it's sort of like an edge to where the pattern is, but, um, and I, I don't know if that's actually a place where it's better to pull hold of the edge. It looks like it's about the same, so it must just be the way the pattern looks. But super, super cute. I would highly recommend it. And I'd be curious if any other people anywhere else happen to have it as well in your area because it's so cute and just a neat idea. So, um, and like I said, there was a solid, I think there were some solid colors and some more like pop art with some pretty floral patterns and things like that. So uh, I have to see maybe if there's something on the website. That's just www.sun-star-st.jp um, but uh, neat stuff so uh, just a quick find that I wanted to share with you guys here today as something that's kind of related to um, you know 
uh, crafts and uh, maybe not so much origami. I mean, the pretty paper pattern design there is pretty, but uh, more more along the craft world. <laughs> Um, if you guys have any questions, uh, please feel free to leave them in the comment section below and I'll have some more fun things to share with you guys in the days to come. Thanks again always so much for watching and I'll see y'all next time. Bye!